if you are in your 20s or you have just found your dream job or you are married and have two or three kids then there is one thing that you definitely want to achieve and that is financial freedom right i mean who doesn't want to go to their favorite country without having to think about their account balance now the question is what do you need to do if you want to achieve that financial freedom well we all know the answer and that is to invest in various things to earn more and on top of that we have all heard that investing in real estate is one of the best options to increase your wealth however the problem is most of us don't understand what real investment actually is how is it beneficial and what types of real estate we have if you want to learn about these important things before you invest in real estate watch this video until the end hi guys this is anjali pradeep we bring to you content about real estate investments properties and developments what real investment actually is in simple words real estate is a specific class of real property that includes land as well as anything permanently attached to that land the land can have man made things such as buildings houses bridges fences attached to it or it can have natural resources such as trees water minerals etc it is important that we talk about the four asset classes as well for those who don't know an asset class is a basic grouping of investments that have similar characteristics and are subjected to similar laws and regulations the four major classes of income producing assets are fixed deposits recurring deposits interest of money in market bank balance and uh, cash equivalents stocks equities mutual funds bonds commodities like gold silver copper crude oil real estate and real estate investment trusts experts suggest that your portfolio should include investments from all the four asset classes talking about real estate investing according to wikipedia it involves the purchase ownership management rental and or sale of real estate for profit with that being said let's quickly discuss the kinds of real estate investments that one could do majorly there are five main categories of real estate these include residential commercial raw or agricultural land industrial lands and special zone lands obviously residential real estate includes any property that we use for residential purposes for example houses condos or apartments townships cooperatives villas duplexes etc the commercial real estate includes any property used for business purposes such as malls complexes parking facilities theaters stores hotels hospitals restaurants etc the other kind of real estate is agricultural land also famously known as the farm lands majorly used for cultivation or to have a farm house away from home on the other hand power plants factories warehouses are examples of industrial real estate which include any property used for manufacturing distribution research storing and development lastly the special zone lands are the kind of real estate which refers to any property that the general public and the government use when we talk about real estate it is also important to discuss the benefits of investing your money in this class of asset it is no doubt that investing in real estate will give you a set of advantages that you won't receive in any other forms of investments or asset classes well did you know that real estate is the only asset that never depreciates in fact this is one of the major reasons why i suggest people invest in this let me tell you that accountants believe every asset on this planet depreciates except the land think about it the land will continue to remain the most valuable asset in the world that appreciates each year however if the population of the world decreases drastically the value of land might drop well that's really unforeseeable in the near future another reason why you should invest in real estate is that it offers a steady and stable stream of income did you know that you can also earn money through investing in real estate investment trusts in this case you won't have to purchase properties instead you will be investing in a company that owns income producing real estate you might be surprised to know that reit space is growing by leaps and and bounds in india since it offers investors an amazing opportunity to partake in huge residential industrial and commercial real estate deals now suppose you invested in real estate by availing a home loan you will be able to claim some amazing tax benefits let me tell you that there are two tax benefits that you can avail for the first house which is self occupied the two benefits are deduction under section 80c In this a maximum of 1.5 lakh can be claimed upon the principal component amount. Interest paid against the home loan is also eligible for tax deduction under section 24. 
In this, you can claim maximum up to 2 lakhs. Here, it is important to note that the benefit under Section 80C isn't available for the second house. So, that's all for today's video and thanks for watching. If you want to connect with us or know more, you can visit our official website. And if you have any queries, you can ask them in the comment section below. I will see you in the next video. Take care and stay tuned.